Hello family, you are so welcome to Natural Hair Abbey again. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you are new here, I just want to say you are warmly, warmly welcome. Over here, I talk about simple DIY um, hair tips that will help you with increased and massive hair growth. And the magic secret is what? Aloe vera, yes. But anyways, today I just want to talk about how I actually uh, maintain my mini twist for increased hair growth through what length retention to show you guys how I maintain it how I keep it in from day to day when I'm going to bed what I do with it and yeah so let's get started. so if you watched my aloe vera um, leave-in conditioner this is what I use from day to day um, I use it as my weekly treatment I also use it as my daily hair hydration wow. let's go into how I just paint it up okay so the painting up I have two different methods if I don't have enough pins, like right now I don't and you know what I have thousand and one bobby pins but most of the times I can only find one so, but I have a couple of them it's not enough but I will show you how I use the bobby pins and what I do when I don't have enough bobby pins so, you can take your head like that and during my mini twist of me video, I showed you guys as well how you can pin this up the hair. And I start from the base, okay? I stretch it out from the base right here. So, don't make it too tight. Sometimes if it's too tight, you can feel it. Uh, so this is it, you see how it, my hair feels stretched already. So the benefits of this method is that it really keeps your hair stretched even for days okay and you keep going like that okay. that side I just moisturize with my aloe vera um, leave-in to make it soft and I'll just do like a very loose twist kind of thing and I use my hands to like, you know, make it whatever it is. It was awesome. It wasn't like this before, right? But now it looks stretched. And if you really do it well, you can keep this in for more than a day. Like you can keep it in for as long as you um, So let's say you don't have a lot of the bobby pins or hair clips or you, or you don't even like the pins at all. There's another way you can go about it. And that is you can either do like flat twist or you can twist a whole bunch of the hair like so and you make it tight but not too too tight okay so so that the hair will be stretched enough like so so we have that so we that this one might not really stretch your hair that much but it will keep it in place and it will keep it stretched not as much as this as you can see because when that stretch the flat twist runs okay flat twist you know how to do like cornrows you can do cornrows as well um that would be also that would also be a great way to um keep it stretched and anytime you're ready to go out you can just loosen it up and you're good to go So I have this um, braid here. All I'm going to do is just pin it up. You can pin it any way you want. Just play along, play around, and just play with it. And depending on how well you do, you can actually go out like that. You know, you don't have to take it off or anything. You can actually go out um, as well. And I'll pin it up. Again, it doesn't matter where you start, it doesn't matter where you end. The whole thing is I'm playing around with the base of the hair. And then also like if you start from here, pin it, just pin it to secure it so that it doesn't shrink back. Just painting anywhere, like if there is like extra, um, extra um, tape of the hair, like that. I just like pin it down. I can pin it down, you know, just to protect my tips because I don't want those tips to be um, rubbing against stuff. I don't want friction to mess it up when I go to bed. So I need to protect those tips 
because that will also help with the length retention now this one you can either take it off or um, you can bring it up here like that like so and then pin it down I will fix it. But, uh, it feels nice and tight it feels really beautiful it feels comfortable to sleep in so and if you put a scarf on and you take it out it gives it a whole different look okay so this is it and then you can keep this hair in like like that so if you're able to keep it in for a week right you can have your aloe vera leave-in conditioner gel or I mean, or juice and all you do is just work around your scalp work around your scalp so you just put it in like so I cut it just pat your head like so just so the aloe vera can sit into your scalp like this give you a chance to treat your hair and give it a nice TLC and by the time we're done with the four months oh my god you will love your hair so I just want to encourage you that if you're now tuning into my channel I'm doing um, two three to four months low hair manipulation and I put in my mini twist protective hairstyle so that I will be able to treat my hair along the way because uh, whilst I'm growing my hair, I still want it to be very healthy. So every treatment that I will do will contain the ingredient aloe vera. So I hope you really enjoyed this video. Please, please, please kindly subscribe down below and click the bell button so that if I upload any new video, you will not miss out. Also, remember to like it and share and comment down below with anything that you want to see, any suggestions. Just let me know whatever you want to see. I am here to help you. This is natural hair again. Remember that your hair grows what you eat. So what? Eat healthy, okay? Ciao. <laughs>